a unique and currently rare subspecies. Lions that can weigh up to 300 kilograms are listed among the largest in the world. Across the rugged terrains of southern and eastern Africa, one lion subspecies stands out as the most massive and formidable of all, Panthera leo melanocata. This lion is more than just a predator. It's a hunting machine, adapted to survive in Africa's harshest and most unforgiving landscapes. But what truly sets this subspecies apart from all the others? Its colossal size. These lions surpass the savanna lions in both weight and size with ease, dominating vast territories and facing challenges few could overcome. Today, we'll delve into the story of the lions of Mount Kenya, unveiling their secrets and exploring whether the African colossus, Sekakama, or the mega lions of Ngorongoro are part of this exceptional lineage. So, remember to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Your subscription and likes are free, and you'll stay updated on all our posts here. Panthera Leo Melanocata, the hidden lions of Mount Kenya. In the shadows of the towering Mount Kenya, a silent story unfolds gradually. This magnificent peak, Africa's second highest, conceals a region of extreme contrasts, where dense forests transform into rugged landscapes marked by rivers and valleys. It's here, among rocky slopes and golden plains, that one of the animal kingdom's greatest secrets was revealed. The existence of the subspecies Panthera leo melanocata. For centuries, lions have ruled Kenya's plains, organizing themselves into prides and fiercely defending their territories. Living in structured groups, these predators stand out for their powerful coalitions, where males join forces to secure leadership. Yet this well-known dynamic among wildlife researchers concealed something more in the lands around Mount Kenya. A line of lions that grew larger, stronger, heavier, and stood out for their imposing presence. During an expedition in the 1930s, researchers, intrigued by reports of giant lions sighted near Mount Kenya, decided to investigate further. By monitoring local populations, they encountered individuals that exceeded all previous records, lions that defied all expectations regarding size and strength. Savannah lions, Panthera leo, at their peak, weigh around 250 kilograms, but these easily surpass that mark in extraordinary fashion. Detailed analysis confirmed that this was no ordinary variation, but rather a distinct subspecies adapted and evolved to thrive in these unique conditions. Thus, Panthera leo melanocata was finally introduced to the world. Today, Panthera leo melanocata is spread across vast areas of southern and eastern Africa. Although their roots are deeply tied to the lands around Mount Kenya, these lions have expanded their range over the decades, seeking new territories. From the savannas of Kenya and Tanzania to the expansive plains of Namibia and Botswana, this subspecies has adapted to various environments. Their presence is notable in protected areas like Serengeti National Park, Maasai Mara, and even the most arid, challenging regions of Botswana. What particularly captivates researchers and wildlife enthusiasts is the theory linking Panthera leo melanocata to the legendary Sekakama, the colossal lion of Botswana. Renowned for his enormous size and unmatched strength, Sekakama ruled over the Okavango Delta, becoming one of the largest lions ever documented. It's believed his ancestors directly descend from the lineages that migrated from Mount Kenya southward, crossing territories and adapting to diverse climatic and ecological conditions in Southern Africa. This suggests that the genetic traits making Sekakamo an icon could be the same that drive Melanocato lions to reach remarkable sizes. We even have a video on Sekakamo on this channel. This story of migration and adaptation is more than just a tale of a species. It's a testament to the resilience and evolution of lions. And with that, we wonder, how far can these giant lions go and what other secrets might they still hold? The Ngorongoro Crater is among Africa's most fascinating and mysterious landscapes. A massive volcanic caldera formed millions of years ago. It shelters one of the continent's densest concentrations of wildlife including lions significantly different from those in the savannah. The lions of Ngorongoro Crater are known for their enormous size, 
and many experts believe they are direct descendants of the Panthera Leo Melanocata subspecies. After all, their bodies are massive, with dense musculature and bone structure allowing them to reach dimensions that few other lions can. Currently, a team of dedicated researchers is sequencing these felines' DNA to confirm if this lineage traces back to the powerful lions of Mount Kenya and if the unique environment of the crater further enhances their growth and strength. Garandaro Crater, with its fertile soil and abundant prey species like wildebeests, zebras, and buffaloes, creates an environment where lions have access to a rich and steady diet, fostering the development of larger and stronger bodies. The combination of plentiful food and minimal outside competition, since the crater walls deter other major predators, provides lions with an ideal environment to thrive. And yes, we also have videos about Ngorongoro lions here on the channel. Historical records reveal the impressive potential of these felines. The largest recorded lion of the Panthera Leo Melanocata subspecies measured 3.35 meters in length and weighed an astonishing 375 kilograms. This giant was documented in Tanzania, another location where Panthera Leo Melanocata is confirmed to exist. And that's not all. Near Mount Kenya, an exceptionally heavy male lion was recorded at 272 kilograms further reinforcing the link between these enormous felines and this subspecies. In 1936, in eastern Transvaal, a notorious man-eating lion was killed, weighing around 313 kilograms, marking one of the heaviest wild lions ever documented. And in 1963, two lions in Tanzania were taken down and recorded at weights of 320 and 360 kilograms after a confrontation with local cattle. These nearly unbelievable figures reinforce that Africa's largest and most formidable lions belong, indeed, to the Panthera Leo Melanocata subspecies. These impressive weights and measurements highlight how this subspecies stands out among Africa's great felines, and how the Ngorongoro crater environment may further amplify their traits if proven that this subspecies made it to the crater. The next few years will confirm whether or not this is true. Today, the majestic subspecies Panthera leo melanocata persists in some of Africa's most iconic regions. Most of its population is concentrated in protected areas in the continent's southeast, where these imposing lions can be found in places like Kruger National Park in South Africa, the Okavango Delta in Botswana, and parts of Namibia and Zimbabwe. Their presence is also notable in Tanzania, especially in the vast savannas of the Serengeti. These areas, true wildlife sanctuaries, have become essential fortresses for the conservation of these giants. It's estimated that the Panthera Leo Melanocata lion population is around 20,000 to 25,000 individuals, a number that, while impressive, is still far from secure for the long-term survival of the subspecies. Protecting these areas and reducing human-wildlife conflicts are essential to ensure these felines continue roaming the continent's vast plains and arid regions. What do you think about this subspecies that reaches incredible sizes and weights? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more amazing wildlife stories. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.